For my documentary, I chose to research common stereotypes about Menlo School and its students. To do so, I interviewed five students from five different schools to learn what they thought of Menlo School. From my interviews, I tried to discern where the stereotypes were originating and what were the most common stereotypes. Also, I wanted to find out why Menlo School was so often targeted with these stereotypes. What do you think the general perception of Menlo School is? Kids who are either preppy and rich or have like a lot of privileges. I think the general perception of Menlo School is a bunch of snobbish, spoiled kids that have a lot of money. Um, well, really rich kids. Uh, kind of, a lot of them think they're better than a lot of people. And, yeah. I've heard that people with a lot of money have paid their way into the school and not actually earning their way through grades or merit, but just like wealth. What influences your feelings towards Menlo School? Well, I didn't get into Menlo, which is kind of a bummer. Um, well, I think the wealth factor comes from Menlo's location, because Menlo is located in pretty much the heart of Atherton um, and in a little bit of Menlo Park, and people from those areas generally have a lot of money and um, have the ability to pay Menlo's income. Probably my friends that go there, they, uh, they say stuff and how, like, the kids they like and the kids they don't like and what they do and all that stuff. Where do you think these perceptions originate? Um, a lot of it's got to be the tuition to go to Menlo, because, I don't know, it's more expensive than some colleges. Competition, probably with other schools in both sports and academics. Do you feel that there's any truth in these perceptions? Uh, well, based on a few kids I know from Menlo, there's definitely some truth, but then it's completely wrong about others. A few kids follow that stereotype. Um, I think there's some truth with some of the people, but not everyone. No, I, I'm sure like there are a lot of them who are rich or preppy, but um, I'm... I like mental kids, so I don't. I don't think it's all true. Um, I think every private school or public school has their their preppy kids. I mean, it's just a way to dress. It's really not that big a deal. Also, I think no matter where you go, you're gonna find a kid who thinks it's better than someone else. So I don't think that these stereotypes are unique to Menlo. I think that they may have a little bit of truth, but I think that they are true for other schools besides Menlo as well.